Why should you test your Y DNA? Uh, the first reasons anybody tested Y DNA were for law enforcement and judicial purposes to determine paternity. Um, then it became uh, then it became useful for people who are adopted and want to know, or if their or if their father or their grandfather was adopted, and they want to know uh, who was their father or great grandfather or great great grandfather. Um, a lot of people do a Y chromosome test to hopefully find out who that person is. Um, now there are uh, other reasons why you may want to do it, even if you know that who your father is or and your grandfather and his father and maybe you even know that for the past 500 years uh, people with your surname and probably your lineage on the male line were all living in the same town uh, you may still find it interesting to know which ancient people uh, your male line ancestors were associated with where they were living uh, where were they living during the time of the Great Migrations after the fall of the Roman Empire? Uh, where were they living during the Roman Empire or maybe even during the time that the Celts were dominant in most of Europe? Uh, where were they in the Bronze Age? Where were they uh, when farming was introduced to various parts of the world? Were they a farmer, likely? Did they spread along migration routes? uh that agriculture is known to have uh passed through or were they likely uh people that were already in the area and were hunter gatherers um you can we can learn this if uh enough people that are closely enough related to you have done similar tests uh and if there is some ancient dna in your uh ancestral line that we have found and tested uh you can test in a lot of different companies, and then um, and then uh, you should ask someone to help you who knows a lot about your haplogroup because it's not easy to interpret the results. Uh, once you know what your Y chromosome SNP is, that's also called terminal subclade, uh, SNP, um, you can look this up on Phylogeographer. Um, click where it says your haplogroup by SNP and just type in the code. It's usually one or two letters followed by some, some digits. Type that in, and uh, if, if uh, YFL recognizes that SNP, then you will see, you'll be redirected to a theoretical migration computed by Phylogeographer, which is a website that I've developed. Thank you.